seeing all the debris. It's reliving a nightmare over and over and over. This house is where our grandkids were raised. This is the only home that they knew. It was very devastating for them to see the house go down. We built it, you know, from the ground up, the property just added on as we could. We were young when we started with the house and every penny we earned that we could save, we would put it here. We only made it to the middle of the driveway. I think we both went into shock. Our Lord Jesus, he spared us. And we're very thankful to him for that. The first thought that came to my mind was God speaking to me, this is only your earthly home. I have a better home for you guys, waiting for you guys. And that has consoled me because that is the real truth. And so when I saw Samaritan Purse drive up, I knew it was a God sent. I knew God had been listening to my prayers to cut all these burned trees. My heart was just so big and so thankful. I think I got a hug from each and every one of you and, and prayed with you guys. And it was just the best feeling. They've done a lot of good work clearing out the trees that we're not going to make it. To give us that peace has changed our perspective. We will see the change for the better. And we could see already the new growth of all the oaks. It's a blessing. It's a blessing that as much as it burned, and they all burn, but they're all coming back. It's a feeling of life after death. Yep. God's uh, new life coming up. Samaritan Purse has brought a lot of peace to our hearts, to our minds. Last night was one of my first nights that I was able to sleep without having to wake up with the nightmare of burn. And it's all thanks to Samaritan Purse. <laughs>